Hey, this is Dan DeLong again, and in this topic we're going to talk about the different ways to, to accept mobile payments. Now there are two apps that you could use when accepting mobile payments. There's QuickBooks Online, the mobile app, and Go Payment. Now why would you want to use one over the other? So in the QuickBooks Online mobile app, that's going to allow you to do a little bit more of your accounting and charging credit cards. Yes, you can accept mobile payments just by tapping on the invoice payments option and then that will charge the card at that time. Or you could actually go into sales receipts. Uh, if you select a new sales receipt, you can uh, put the customer on it, you can add items. All of these items are going to be in your QuickBooks Online anyway, so you can specify the price. Uh, you just tap on the items as, as you want to add them and you, if they don't have the price you can put in uh, the rate uh, you can then mark whether it's uh, taxable or not um, all of this will feed back into your quickbooks online as well so that's the big advantage of using the app as opposed to using just go payment so using go payment just allows you to accept mobile payments directly on your on your mobile device so you would just go in and record the payment uh, just as normal uh, so really the the difference is whether you want to charge credit cards and do your accounting at the same time or if you just want to charge the credit cards mobily. <laughs>